Yeah, we are many who have a lot of thoughts going along in this time and uh, worrying about what's going to happen, what it's happening now, what can we do, and so much more turmoil into our brain, into our mind that sometimes affect us into our actions and that is difficult to guide our action and to still stay positive and remain into a proactive way in, of living. So it's when, when we notice that with the element is as having the fire into our heart of having the fire up to manifest something, but the thoughts keep coming. And so many thoughts that just drift our fire and we just don't know where to go anymore. And I have experienced that like being like in between two or three places or situations and uh, and then it's, it's sometimes the opportunity to actually look deeper, look more into our heart and um, releasing the mind for a moment. So I want to invite you to explore that inner flame, that inner fire and noticing how we can release the thoughts, take a space for all those worries, all those thoughts and give space to the shining heart. And from there, learn that our mind will serve our heart. Our mind will serve our heart purpose. And um, whatever will make our heart sing and feel like it's in a good vibration, in a healthy space, that's when we can really build up and move along. All is coming really from that space of love, of compassion. And when, when we allow and release the fear from the heart, release the resistance from the heart or the worry from the heart, it can bloom again, like in the spring. So um, I use usually the fire element. We have like a spray, like in essential oils, that helps to feel better and breathe into it. There is also the um, essential oils that we can use and um, with a friction and it can be friction to the hands, to the feet, also friction on the chest to activate and open more towards the thymus and the heart and release all the stress we may feel. And then we can also take a drop and place it below the tongue to tune into the frequency of that fire, the frequency of our expression and our self-confidence. So I invite you to observe. You can also see I wear the mala of the fire element, which is the jade. And the jade helps for confidence, for compassion, for love and kindness, with also the pink quartz and um, tiger eye. So the tiger eye, especially for the self-confidence. And sometimes the tiger eye can be very strong and powerful, like the leader and, and get really, really into our power of fire. But I combined it with like a green color and pink to soothen it down. So we're also very receptive to others. And it's, it's that balance into that interaction between each other. So I want you all for a moment to settle in, take a moment to breathe. And observe the thoughts that are there and observe how that affects your fire, how that affects your heart. Sometimes we may disconnect with our thoughts and mind to be aware from the heart or to try to protect So you breathe a little deeper and observe how the breath can reach to the heart, to your lungs and feel the expansion into your chest. If you notice many thoughts still in your mind, you will inhale into that inner fire, into that light. And you exhale gently through the mouth and just take a space. 
and again inhaling into the heart and exhaling through the mouth observe the thoughts the worries just in front of you a little away from you and tune more into your heart Deepen the breath to the heart, to the chest. And observe if you can listen to your heartbeat. And as you inhale, feel a light coming from the crown of the head, going all the way to your heart. You feel like um, you can even visualize a, a green, pink color in your heart, nurturing and easing any stress from the heart. And visualize a warm flame and sensation into our chest as the raising of the sun. If you still notice any worries, resistance, just breathe and exhale, visualize those little away from you sending them love and tuning in the heart now feel the heart expanding within your chest and access that voice of the heart Feeling the warm sensation opening, releasing any stress or any burden from your chest. And give space for that warmth, loving sensation. And envision that that warmth from your chest, from the heart, expands through your arms and all the way to your hands. Feel that warm sensation tuning and moving all the way to the belly as well. So you feel the movement from the heart bring the warmth within your whole body. Take a break from the thoughts, the turmoil, the worries. And access the voice of the heart. Learn that your own thoughts can listen to the heart, to your heart's needs. What brings you warmth? What brings you ease? What makes you feel good? Deepening on the breath. Give space. If you can tune deep into that light within, observe what makes your heart sing today. What's your rhythm? 
What's your inspiration today? What nurtures your inner fire today? Learning to transcend the ego, the belief system, and just open to the heart. Feel that warmth, fully embodied. And gently place your hands to the heart. And you smile to your heart and you observe your heart smiling back at you. Visualize a heart's medicine. Feel that love, that kindness, that inspiration. For you to take leadership today from your heart. And you can like swallow and place your right hand on the belly, feeling good grounding and integration, like your arm body the call from the heart. And you visualize yourself surrounded by that love, by that light, with four portals around you, one on the east, one on the south, one on the west, one on the north, and we are right in the middle, connecting to the sky, divine light, and connected to the earth. And we shine bright just in the center of this vortex of light. We take a deep inhale. We exhale through the mouth. And we'll chant three arms. Connecting from the belly to the heart to the third eye for the activation of a vortex of light and love and kindness. Gently, you can place your hands over your face. And come back, open the eyes. And remember to listen to the heart. Even when sometimes worries, turmoil, securities come along the way, Coming back to the heart, many answers are right there. Namaste.